Okay, let's go on. Welcome back to another episode of Fish Flesh Hunting South. In this episode, I'm going to be showing you how to make jug lines. Now, these aren't the types we have in the other video, but these are some I'm going to make up and I made up today. Anyway, all I did was took a pool noodle you can get from the dollar store or anything, and I cut it in about a foot, foot and a half sections. And then anyway, with that, I'm going to take my little section. And what I did is I cut me a little hole in it. I don't know if y'all can see that. I just cut me a little slit in it. I'm going to take some line. I'm going to measure off about an arm length. Arm length. About half of a note. Take it. Cut it. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it and wrap it around. So I found that little hole in there. Found it. My line sits perfectly down in there. I'm going to take my line. I'm going to do an overhand knot. Which will make it a nice knot. Take it. Just like that. That ain't coming off. I'm going to take the excess. Cut it off. Right with that right there, that ain't going nowhere. The big fish gets on there, it ain't going nowhere. Then we'll take the rest of it, just toss that aside. Get on this end, and we'll take this weight right through the end, and all the way and run it down to the bottom. So you know you see it's on the bottom. And then I'll take this, go up about yay much, and loop it around. I'll loop it around and make me a little nice little knot. Just like that. Try to get it as close as you can. Get the line that you're not to the end of your line, not too close. Like that. Now you got just a nice loop down here. And now I'm going to be using some Adolf J hooks. My weights, I'm using some just. Whatever those are, egg sinkers, lead. Take my eight off J hook. Right through the end. Up the eye. Flip all the way through. Alrighty. And now you're just going to take the back end. You're going to put it like that. And boom. You got your last little jug line done. And I am going to, be, going to be showing y'all how to make some other different types of noodles that we'll probably make here in the near future. But till then, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.